afternoon. Good afternoon. I guess to start off, you know, you hear all about how hard it is to win here. You, you see your team's record here over the past, you know, two decades. Is it maybe unexpected that you guys get your first road win this year at this place? Well, I don't think as a basketball team you go in a, in a game with the attitude of winning is unexpected. Um, I think I wasn't really whether we play here against who we play, we just need a, a win. And we all kn knew that um, it's very important for us still the back against our wall, so against the wall, so um, not really. How much confidence does it give you knowing that you guys have four, four of your next six are on the road getting this road win? Um, for sure, it's great to have a finally a first road win. I mean, we know that that we are over six uh, on the season on the, on the road, so there's a certain anger or on yourself and a certain like how can you say it like certain ambition to be the team on the road. Uh, it feels really great and um, I hope we can take that momentum into the home game on Thursday which is a huge one and then we have a I think two game road stretch that is very important as well. What did you have you noticed that progression throughout the season? Has it, or has it been something that you've seen also? Well, he's doing a great job. I mean, he's just very good in using his like arms. He's so long and fast in his feet, so it's really a big advantage he has and uses pretty well. Um, I'm pretty pretty proud of him. Really. He does such a great job. Does that change your mindset when you're going against a guy like Thomas Bryant? Uh, when you, know you have DJ Wilson there. Um, well, not really, to be honest, because. Well, today we, we kind of tried to double him a little bit, so obviously it changed his mindset because he got to play differently. But, um, yeah, I know obviously it's great to have a shot blocker in your... In your I, sh I shouldn't say that as a big man, that I have, another, that I have a shot blocker in, on my team. I should be the shot blocker, but, um, yeah, it's obviously great to have. That, that back-to-the-wall mentality you mentioned earlier, was, was there a specific game that you thought that sort of emerged maybe amongst the team? <laughs> Well, I think after our Iowa State game, we just understood like it's not about it's not about the opponent, it's not about anything environment, anything else. It's just about us. Like if if we've been playing the way we can, uh, we can beat against any team, and uh, we can lose against any team. But if we uh, if we play as good as we can, uh, we can beat any team. Uh, that's our mindset right now, and. I think it helps a lot having such a good win at home against Michigan State, and we took that momentum in here, and it's just on us to keep going like that. With, with, with this the, being your first road game after the Ohio State game, is there maybe a different mentality with this road game compared to the first few road games you played no, this year? No. We just needed a win. It doesn't matter where, how, just need a win. The play where uh, Coach Green kind of got, got knocked over. Here for you guys. Kinda, what exactly happened? What was your 